and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you what I got at my Trader Joe's grocery haul. If you want to see what $169 got me, please keep watching. I just need to put my hair in a little bun. Anyway, so let's start with the first bag. I got dry cranberries. Um, and I got these so I can add them into salads. I don't like salads very much, as you can tell. But, um... I try salads that my mom has made at her house with cranberries, dry cranberries, and it tastes really good, so I'm gonna give that a try. Um, I got also some sea scallops. I got a bag of sea scallops. Um, this was a little expensive, it was this little bag it was like almost 20 bucks, but um, I'm, we're trying to, you know, change a little bit of our, of our diet um i want to add some more seafood into our diet so scallops is one of my favorites i don't like fish but i do like these type of things okay so i got some on cure slow cook ham and this is for tommy not for me he loves sandwiches so we didn't have any ham and this is this is the perfect amount like you see it's the perfect amount so it doesn't go bad on us because Tommy's the only one who eats that. Uh, for other meats, I got some beef filet mignon steaks. Two pieces. This was about $15 for the pair. And I love making this with like mashed potatoes or, or roasted potatoes or something like that. We really love that. Um, I got a red pepper because i have another one there and i actually want to try to make some stuffed peppers that i saw a recipe online and i think that's what i'm going to make tonight actually um i got some organic baby bella mushrooms there you go um and yeah like i said i want to incorporate a little bit more vegetables in our diet and i i really like mushrooms so you can do them with um with the steak salted and stuff is really really good so I got some sliced fresh pineapple. Um, I don't eat pineapple. Tommy's the one that eats it. So this is some of the fruits that Tommy eats. So I got that for him. I got some kosher beef stew meat. And there's no particular reason why I got them kosher. I, I actually wanted to try them. I never had tried kosher meat i don't know what's the difference but it was actually cheaper than the um than the actual beef like the beef stew meat that i normally buy so i thought it was still this was nine dollars i got a mozzarella whole meat low moisture cheese um and the reason why i got this because i want to make a lasagna and mozzarella cheese is the only cheese you can use to make the lasagna that i like to make Oh, it looks like these are my meats. Um, I got some fresh organic breast, breast tenders. And yeah, more meat. Now I got some ground beef. I love the ground beef from Traders because it's 90% lean, 10% fat. So it's really, really good. And I like them for either pastas or actually for the stuffed peppers that I might be making today. Mm. Okay, so I saw this. This is new. I've never tried this before, but this is organic acai puree packets. And I was like, oh my gosh, I used to drink smoothies every single day. I actually lost a ton of weight when I was doing that for breakfast. I don't eat breakfast every day. Um, it, it makes my stomach squeezy. So um, I'm actually going to try these on my smoothies. They say acai, it's really good. So I'm going to give it a try. And then for... I got these, this is a more of like fast food, if you can call it that. This is a garlic potatoes with Parmesan, Parmesan sauce. And this is more of me cooking something fast because I got home late and I don't have enough time to prep a whole meal. So I'm trying that, that's new. I have never tried it before. Hi. I almost dropped this. Ah! Okay, so now i had i got a organic grill pack two slip breasts and four drumsticks 
and the only reason why i got this is because i normally just get like i show you before the the um, the chicken tenders but i want to make this dish equivalent dish i'll probably film it um that you make it with whole whole chicken pieces so i might try that um what else did they put in this bag oh, i put um i also bought a pork ter ten tenderloin boneless pork tenderloin um i like this dish that um my mom showed me how to make is with uh beans and no no beans how do you call that beets no it's not beets either i can't remember anyway um there's this dish that i like to do that has vegetables and sometimes you put broccoli on them and yeah i want to make it up uh, this week so that's why i got this bonus tin loans and this was just only five bucks and it's organic so yeah i i actually like that and then for my smoothies i got organic mixed berries blend and this you know i just pop it in the freezer and i just grab as i go for my smoothies all right so that's that for that bag let me put this on the side so i can ah okay so I Kind of heavy. Oh, so I got a watermelon. Um, well, sounds like it's kind of ready, but I'm gonna leave it there for a little bit before I cut it into little pieces. And what I like to do with watermelons is that I open it and I cut it in little pieces and leave it inside the fridge. And um, yeah, so we can eat it as a snack. This is really good, especially now that it's getting warm. Ooh, don't fall. Okay, so for more meats, I got some fresh Atlantic salmon. Uh, normally I don't buy farm-raised um, salmon, but um, it was pretty good price and I haven't eaten salmon in a long time, so I thought it was, it was good. So I purchased, it was like $8. So I got, more meat i got some argentinian shrimp these are really these are big pieces and that's why i love this argentinian red shrimp um i love it i normally eat this for like either a ceviche or i make them for shrimp tacos okay so now this is something that i discovered the other day the like another time that i went to two years this is a fully cooked pork belly this thing is amazing it's just delicious you just pop it in the oven make some mashed potatoes and that's it super easy super fast and um there's not that much sodium in this it's only 190 calories can you believe that so i love this stuff so i bought a, a few of them because tommy loved it last time you can do them in tacos i like to do them with uh with mashed potatoes and it's just a little piece it's like this box it looks big but it's just a little piece this big so it's not much that's why i bought three of those so i can i stuck up on that because last time they didn't have any all right so then oh wait let squeeze this so then i got some Freshly squeezed orange juice. This thing is delicious. Um, I can't drink orange juice in the like early in the mornings, but this is this juice is so refreshing. It's freshly squeezed. I love it, and it's Tommy's favorite. So I most of the time I get this for him, not for me. But yeah, it's delicious. Now I buy whole milk. I just buy a half a gallon. You know, the only person that drinks meal in this house is me, and I like wholemeal milk. Um, yeah, I used to drink, you know, 2%, but now it's like, whatever. I don't care. Um, and then I bought these snacks, and I bought actually, I bought this for Tommy. These are mozzarella and prosciutto ham snacks, and they're really good to, for, you know, to have them for the go. These were like $1.30 each, and... Yeah, Tommy likes it, so he likes it so he can take a snack with him when he goes to work. All right, my last bag. So I got some bananas, a bunch of bananas. We love bananas in this house. And for my smoothies, we need tons of it, tons of it. 
So I got a yellow onion. I got some kiwis. I have I got five kiwis. Number five. Actually, I never tried kiwis until until like last week. My mom gave me kiwis and I love them. And she said that this is so good for you. These are organic kiwis and yeah, so I bought some kiwis for me. Um, so I bought some apples, two apples. I'm the one who eats apples in this house. Somebody doesn't know me apples. And I got some lime and some lemon because um, I'm actually gonna make some lime or lemon juice because um, I heard that it's good for you. I cannot have like acid things, but if I drink them with water, like very diluted with water, I can. So I'm gonna start doing that. So I bought plenty of them so I can, you know, have them in a, in a jar in the fridge. And lastly, I got some golden potatoes. And yeah, so I can make mashed potatoes because mashed potatoes is Tommy's favorite thing. Um, I actually missed, um, I forgot to get eggs. That's the only thing that I missed from my grocery list. And I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. Um, but yeah, I miss eggs, but that's like another five bucks. So technically speaking, this whole thing, if I would have gotten the guests, it would have been like 175 bucks. But this is it, guys. That's all I got for $169 at the organic grocery store. So normally my two week grocery shopping looks like this. Uh, normally I spend a little bit less than 107, but I got some seafood and seafood tends to be more expensive. So that's not something that I do every other week. Um, I normally buy once a month and then the next one, it's completely different and um, I might buy it again. I don't know. I'm like I said. I want to incorporate some uh, seafood in our in our meal. So, yeah, that's that's all I got, guys. That's my whole grocery shopping uh, Trader Joe's. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I, like I said before, I love Trader Joe's. I have another video that I'll probably link it on the icon right here. And um, so you can see it, the last time that I went to Trader that's how much I spend normally um, on my hauls. Again, like I said, this will last me probably like, like two weeks. This is enough for two weeks. And that includes us going out for dinner because I don't wanna cook. Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up if you like it. And if you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe down below. Thank you so much. Bye.